What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com and in the last Dynasty video we took on Kentucky, had a crazy game. We had a decent lead towards the fourth quarter but they got a couple touchdowns late keeping it close but we got the victory and we're 1-0 and today we're taking on a future SEC team and that is Missouri. They haven't played a game yet. They got a little more talent than we do. They run a spread offense. I think their playbook is a lot of ace and gun, according to the scouting report. And they run a 4-3 defense. And they tend to run the ball a bit more than usual. Now, normally, Missouri has more mobile quarterbacks, so we'll probably have to go up against that again today, like we've done against Kentucky. But we'll see what happens there. All right, let's... One thing I do want to show you, I noticed... Look at all the ranked teams that I put on the schedule. Ohio State lost their first game. Notre Dame has already lost a game. Oregon State is 1-0. And then you got Virginia Tech, they're 1-1. So I'm just bad at picking ranked teams in terms of them being really good. Last year, it, it went pretty well. You know, UCLA and Michigan had amazing seasons. And, of course, Michigan won the national title. But I was uh, thumbing through the schedule. I just kind of noticed all my ranked games. All of them are pretty much uh, lost the game except for Oregon State. Nothing we can do about that, though. All right, let's go to end season recruiting. Hopefully the last game helped us along the way in terms of just going up some of these guys' list. Looks like we got a an even or an up arrow for everybody that we're going after. So let's just go back up to the very top. Neil Scales, looks like we're still in good shape here. We've moved up for him. We've stayed the same for this middle linebacker, but we're okay there. Joseph Ward, this is the big uh, pocket passer out of Minnesota. Looks like we're in good shape there. Keith Magruder, middle linebacker, we're looking good there. Vernon Hines, we're moving up a little bit for this guy, wide receiver. We're slowly figuring out that what he doesn't like. Nick Whitaker, I'm really excited about this kid because I like his combination of speed and arm. And we're obviously in great shape here. We just got to keep sticking with it. And we're moving up for the middle linebacker, Deion Brooks. Looks like we're in good shape there. And we're moving up for Craig Hurdle, wide receiver. Looks like we're in good shape there. And uh, I think this is maybe the last guy, strong safety, Lance Beck. Looks like we're still in good shape there. So, I don't really need to make any adjustments. We didn't go down for anybody. The biggest thing is with the loss of Harris, and it looks like we're not going to throw the ball, you know, we're not going to put up crazy passing numbers again this season. It's going to be a real struggle to go after quarterbacks and receivers in the offseason. So, it's imperative that we get, I'd love to get both of those quarterbacks and a couple of those wide receivers at least. That would be excellent. Everybody else, that would be gravy, but we need some help at quarterback and wide receiver. I love Simmons, our quarterback now. I think he'll do just fine, but he's one injury away, and we're really hurting at quarterback. We just need more bodies there. And the same with the receiver. Just need help there in the biggest way. Let's go to Sports Illustrated. Don't think there's going to be a whole lot of change here. I wonder. Let's see. I don't think we're going to be on this list yet. I think we're too far back still. There's your top 10. Heisman watch. I don't know if this would change a whole lot after one week. Uh, LSU looks like is off to a great start. Got a couple guys on the list. Players of the week. I don't really care. Conference status. We can check out our team information. There he is. Harris out for the year. And he's still our leading receiver. <laughs> 43 yards. We just obviously didn't throw the ball a ton after he went down. Davidson is our leading rusher, which is interesting. That's probably going to change, I'm pretty sure. Uh, what's his face? Uh, Gladhar is going to probably take over that in time. But Simmons, I thought he played just fine. The two full, uh, turnovers he did have, they were my fault, so it's not on him. But Abdullah is doing his thing on the defensive side of the ball. Now let's go to the Big 12 and check out... Missouri, if I can get to them, there they are. It's not going to say anything. They haven't played anything, any games yet, so we can't get much from that. I think that is it. i got to show you my new playbook. So, in my post-game thoughts on the last video, 
I mentioned, hey, we're going to have to do a little bit more West Coast stuff just to get our halfbacks and fullbacks involved because they can catch a little bit. Because right now we're very depleted at wide receiver. Outside, and I can go ahead and show you this, just give you a rundown of what's happening. You look at a wide receiver uh, unit. Harris is out, and all is left is Clark at 78, and then it's just a huge drop-off after that. So I'm going to be running a lot of bigger sets. I think I got one four-wide set and maybe a couple three-wide, but the majority of them are two or one. So having said all that, let's go back to the playbook and just kind of run, do a rundown here. Ace normal, I'm going to use this mainly for running. It's got a good speed option and basically all your good runs. I may try to do a little goal line stuff with this. I just want to experiment some with that. A slot, this will be more passing than anything else. But if we're going up against any odd fronts, this would be a good formation to try to go up to gut as well. Uh, I twins, this is mainly for running. I've got one pass play I'm going to fool around with if I don't forget it. But otherwise, we're going to do, this is like the easiest run formation for me. Because... When you're running twin sets or trips, normally the defense likes to shift really hard one way to the other, making it a whole lot easier for you to go to one side or the other. Plus, it's got all the basic runs, slam, dive, op power option, speed option, and such. Pro twins, this is going to be our main West Coast formation. There are a couple new plays in there that I've been fooling around with that you're going to see in time. And there are, I guess, four good, really good pass plays I'm going to use. And it's all West Coast-ish. And that's what that formation is for. Weak tight, I'm going to try to use this as like a goal line formation. I got some cool ideas with this one. I wanted a goal line formation that had a tight end on each side. That also had really good run plays. And this one has quite a bit of it. It's got your fullback over if I needed it. But it's got power option. It also has speed option, if I'm not mistaken. And you can move some guys around. So I'm going to fool around with that. That may be my new goal line formation going forward. We'll just see how it goes, though. Week normal, I'm going to use this mainly for fullback over and against odd fronts. So we can go right up the gut. It's pretty good against, you know, 3 fours and 3 three fives and such. So this will be mainly for running. Then you got uh, gun two-back slot. Nothing's really going to change there. I'm treating it more like a West Coast formation. But I can also do a little bit of speed option if I feel like it. But this is going to be mainly for passing. Gun wide trips, I'm going to use this mainly for like halfback direct, halfback out, and our third and long play, whatever it's called, halfback corner, I believe. And our lone four wide set is gun trips. There are a couple design QB runs I'm going to fool around with this one and see if they work okay. I may do this like when we're in the red zone where Simmons doesn't have to get 60 yards for a touchdown. He only needs like 15. So we'll see how that goes. That's pretty much the offense. I'm sure it'll take me a couple of games to remember all the plays that I want in here. I, I've never really write any of this stuff down. So I'm sure I'll forget a play or two that I wanted to run out of this. But hopefully today you're going to see the entire offense. All right, let's get this show on the road. Let's take on Missouri. It's our first home game of the season. Make sure I get my teleprompter thing set up here. Well, you forgot about that. We didn't get to use that any in the last game. It just didn't work out for whatever reason. And we, I guess we're not going to use it a whole... I mean, I, I tend to use it more when I pass the ball. It's just easier to break down stuff. I can do the same thing for run plays. It'll, I mean, the inspiration hits me when we have a, a particular play. So hopefully I'll get to use it a couple times today. Looks like they got a quarterback that's 90 overall. Yay. Looks like they got a really good defensive line. We're 35th in the country. Of course, after this game, we got Ohio State. Welcome, everyone. All right, we got a pretty night for football. Rocking the blue shirt. We still can't technically fill up the entire stadium. I don't know what's going to take. I see a couple back rows there, not filled. Temperature is just right for the Missouri Tigers and the Murray State Racers. It's been nonstop, hard-hitting football so far. But it's super close to being full. And we hope to continue that as the season goes on. And here come the Racers. Pretty looking uniforms. I love playing on a turf field. 
You see everybody's got like their turf elbow strap on. There's Gladhar. We got to go through our formation subs. We got to do some changes there. And they're picking us. Let's see. Missouri will win the toss, and they want the ball first, which is fine. It's been forever since I've played Missouri. Let's go to our formation subs first. Uh, Gladhar could be our main guy there. Let's see. 87, 88. Okay. Here, yes, I want that to stay the same. Here, that's nothing's going to change there. I'm just kind of looking here. Nothing's going to change there. I still want Davidson in and on a few of these formations. I need Gladhar here because we are going to pass the ball quite a bit out of this formation. Here, I, it's going to be goal line. He needs to be my main guy, so I'm okay with that. He has to be my number one guy just so Davidson can be my fullback, so we're going to use the twin halfback sub package, so I'm okay with all of that there. Here, uh, we can give, I don't think uh, Gladhart's going to touch the ball a ton in this formation, so we can give him a bit of a break and put Davidson here. I don't mind keeping Davidson right there. Just give him something. Then we can have Gladhar right there. That may change over time. Now let's go to defense just to make sure I have Abdullah where he needs to be. And yes. Now one thing I, I need to make in my mind. Who needs to be my number two guy? I got two guys right here. Now if I go down with another injury wide receiver, I'm going to have no choice but to bring uh, freshman Rashad Black into the fold. But I won't have to do that yet. I'm not... We got big sets, and we're really going to see four wide. And in this, in our gun trips formation, we are going to use probably the tight end sub package. Maybe even the halfback slot sub package as well. That's Paul. We'll just see. But I can't decide who needs to be our number two guy. I mean, Johnson is just a humongous individual, and he's much stronger. And we probably need a better blocker, and he can catch about the same. So what I may do, I need to do this outside of the game. But I'm going to put, we're going to have Johnson start at the number two spot. We'll just see how that goes. Okay. I'm a, he should be able to block better than Anderson. We need him to block more than anything else. So we'll just go with that for now. And I'll try, I just need to make a note on Johnson that I have to, because if you start back up another game, he goes back to the number three spot. So you got to make that change outside of a game. All right, let's check out their roster. Well, this is, oh, this is actually pretty good. Chase Patton, he's their starter, and he can't run the ball. He's a pure pocket passer. But his backup, Chase Daniel, who was an awesome ball player back in the day, is an impact guy. So I wonder how they're going to handle that. I think that's really interesting. Hopefully Patton plays the entire time and he doesn't get hurt. Halfback, they got two guys that are pretty much the same thing. Fullback, it just it is what it is. A wide receiver, they don't have much there. They got one decent guy and an okay guy behind him, but it's a big drop off after that. And their tight ends aren't nothing special. This guy is kind of okay, but not really. Let's see, offensive line 85, 78, 76, 82, and 78. Nothing to get excited about. Uh they run a 4 3, 76, and 89 at right end. He looks like a pretty good ball player. 84 speed. Whew. He's kind of small, though. Defensive tackle, 88, 76. Middle linebacker, or left outside linebacker. They got a middle linebacker here at 80 overall. Then you got this guy at 78. Then right outside linebacker, 76. They got an impact corner. I don't know. It's kind of hard to stay away from him in a sense. We could do it, kind of do that in the run game a little bit. Free safety, 78 overall with 85 speed. And a strong safety with 74 overall and 84 speed. We may try to attack both. Neither one is super special. We may go after this guy a little bit more. They got a terrible kicker. He's a true freshman and a terrible punter. So it'll be interesting to see how they handle the quarterbacks. I honestly could see Chase Daniel getting out on the field somehow, some way. We're going to find out. 
And this is the worst kick ever. I hit that button way too early. They're going to get amazing field position. That's my fault. Not sure about that tactic, guys. Uh, I wish I had an we could do some zone blitzing because this quarterback can't run. And nope, Chase Daniel is in there. I, that's awesome that they even thought about that. There he goes. All right, he's going to play some. Now he's wearing the wrong number. I think he finished up with number ten. By the time he left there, I could be dead wrong. Second and less than a yard. I knew they would put him in there. The Tigers line up with two tight ends. We'll go quarters for now. That's a good stop right there. All right, so it is what third and third and two. What I may try to do is where's it at? I, uh, do this double defensive end spy. It's a cover one. I'm just hoping that they. Run the ball. The Tigers come out the shotgun. Drops back to pass. He steps up. Look, he'll dump this one off. That's a good play right there. Pick up a first. That's how you convert on third down. This defense had to be expecting pass. I know that. It doesn't matter though. Let's go quarters again. I'm definitely not going to do any blitzing. As long as he's out there, you can't do it. Interception by Crosby, the true freshman. I got right in front of it, just let it sit there. Let's see if it shows us a good instant replay. Not too bad. I just got right in front of it. Now, let's see. Do I need to do any sub packages? I need to do twin halfback, twin halfback. The rest of that I'm okay with. Let's go with... Let's just start here. If I can find it. We're going to do tight end corner. They're, on the right They're going side zone 4-3. This will be one of our line. West Coast plays. Just to get our halfbacks going a little bit. Murray State lines up Help in out in the down. passing game. He's looking for his man. Get Myers about five Bring yards down. there. A good route there and was able to pick up yards under we all, oh, yes. I need to go back. I forgot. Let's go to our formation subs. Um... We got to think about our tight ends. I completely forgot about this. Just make sure. I still want green here. Olsen there. Green there. That's going to stay the same because both tight ends are out there. Right here, we need to put... Olsen is out there. That's good. And uh, I want green still there. Uh, I actually may put Olsen there. And from here, we'll do our... A sub package right there, probably the halfback or the tight end sub package. At least that's the plan. We'll see. A lot of moving parts. All right, they're going man four three. We're going to do speed option. We got a look at that tight end on the left. He's humongous. He should be able to block for us pretty decently. I'm just going to dive. Just pick up the first down. I'm not going to let him get hit. That was a spectacular We're good there. keeper there. Uh, you why. It looked like that play was going nowhere, but this quarterback made Let's start right here. Let's go back and to the football. You're right. Good heads up play there. I found a new play I've been fooling around with. Let's call it. Let's go RB cross. It's We're going team. man. Ball on the 32. As is, I should be able to give this to Gladhar. Hopefully Murray he gets State decent separation here. Field. Nope, Look it ain't happening. Right. We're gonna run with this. Looks like he's gonna run. Pick up about eight yards. We can break this play down. I'll, I'll show you the two man beaters. I finally get to use my teleprompter thing. Let's see. Let's go here and let's pick blue. Uh, let's go with this line here. Now, I have this guy on a, like a double post. This is my cover zero beater. Otherwise, if I see a cover one or cover two, I'm going to go to Gladheart right here. Now, we're hoping that... Like, this guy, this guy, or, you know, somebody is covering him. That way there's some decent separation. On this particular play, it didn't happen. Somebody picked him up pretty easily. Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. You just never know. Nobody else was really open from what I could tell. And did they go cover zero? They did, didn't they? Well, I'm an idiot. They went cover zero. <laughs> they did go cover zero. I'm an idiot. All right. Probably gave up a touchdown on that one, but that's okay. So where are we? We are on the right hash. Let's go. 
Let's do fullback over and let's get Davidson going. They're going man 5 2. As long as they don't shift hard to the left, I think we'll be okay. Ooh, let's see. Let's bring this impact corner over. Yep, we're going to get some yards here. I almost get the touchdown. All right, we are at the one yard line. We can fool around. I do need to. Have, okay, I already got the sub package set put in there. We got like. Uh, let's do. Halfback blast. They are going. I, I may just leave him in there. Let's just see if this works or not. It may not. I, I know they're going to go goal line here. I, don't, I didn't mean to jump. <laughs> we got the touchdown. It was ugly. I hit triangle and I didn't mean to. <laughs> I forgot to use the right joystick and move it up to cover the ball and I didn't. I jumped right there. <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't fumble it. Well, we got our touchdown. So we're off to a pretty good start. We'll kick an extra point, then we'll get back on defense. on the extra point and now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary so hopefully the new offense will help things a little bit just Hurry gotta adjust your town the best you can a little bit better kick you should get this like around the 35 Number 34, signals for a fair catch. if I can find a better kick in the offseason I will we're gonna go back to quarters so even with Chase Daniel being the number two guy on the depth chart, they still have him out there. So it's kudos to the game for still recognizing that. Somebody get him. He's going to do that a lot today, I'm afraid. I'm going to stick with quarters to keep everything in front of us. They're loving this ace trips play. I wish I liked that formation more. I just don't. They call that same play again. Exact same play. That's a good stop. So where are we? We're it's third and eleven. We'll go cloud for now. If they don't start picking up everybody, then this quarterback's gonna be pretty sore in the morning. That's for sure. Trips left. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket with the throw. Ah, well. Just a first down. That's how you convert third down. Nothing you can do about that one. So it looks like they want to pass quite a bit because of the quarterback, which is I'm okay with. Now watch them run right up the gut. Going half back draw. Good stop there. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. We'll go quarters. I'm just gonna do a lot of soft zones today. I feel like I got no other choice. I got a lot of field to cover over here. Ah, dang it. He dove. He tried to dove for the interception. That obviously didn't work, and it's first and ten. Let's go back to quarters. That was my fault all the way. Halfback draw. Had to get another tackle. I may get a lot of user tackles today. I'm afraid to go man, they'll just pass off of it and get a big gain. Nice play fake. He's looking. Good defense. I felt very uncomfortable trying to intercept that, so I just hit the L1 button. And they swarmed to the football. They're always making And I pressed the wrong one. Yeah, we'll go quarters, that's fine. It may not matter what we call here. He drops back. Over the Intercept that. Golly. They're just slowly going down the field. Making plays. First and ten. Ball in the Quarter's about over with. Line up with three wide. They're just taking up a ton of clock. QB design. Oh, no. I guess that was a speed option. I thought that was a QB sprint or something. There was nothing there on that option. Good thing that wasn't a turnover. I thought he was going to... We're struggling on third down. We, we're doing a halfway decent job of... Getting to third down. 
That's a good play right there. Just to hole up the B gap. So now it's... Uh, let's go with a 4-4. I can see him maybe running there, or they may go play action off of it. Going gun ace. Daniel lines up in the shotgun. Drops back to pass. He steps up, looks. Dang it. I swear, I shouldn't have dove for that. This has been a disastrous drive. I mean, nothing's going right on it. So if they seem destined to get a touchdown here, we just can't seem to stop it. They need to take the intensity that is working on first and second downs and save some for third down because they're just getting outworked. Daniel hands it off. We're just Martin. delaying the inevitable unless we get super lucky on a play. So it's 7 nothing, but they're fixing to tie this thing. We can do like a 4 3. I'm going to do like an all out blitz. Where's the outside? There it is. Fire green. They set up in the shotgun here by the goal line. Keep an eye on the quarterback. I wouldn't be surprised to see a draw here. They may do the halfback off tackle play, and they are. Big stop right there. All right, so it's third and goal. Third and nine, technically. The key is I'm going to take a chance. We're going to go fire two. Just sit back there in soft zone. It's not helping a whole lot. Daniel with three wide receivers. Back to pass. And it just, yeah. It doesn't matter what I call. He's just making plays. So he's going to give us fits all day, I'm afraid. I don't know what to call, to be honest. We're just throwing every type of thing at him, and it's not working. We'll figure it out. He felt the blitz. I guess it's my fault. I should not be doing any blitz on this cat. As soon as he sees it, he just runs off with it. So this may be a high-scoring affair. One thing we can hope for is just more turnovers by him, just making bad throws. Just don't fumble it, don't fumble it. We are on the right hash. I'm going to go here. Let's go RB clear out. We're going zone. Don't know what we're going to get out of this one. Murray State lines up in a pro set. Simmons drops back on first down. And a sack. Somebody came right on through. I don't know what happened there. Just somebody came through. Second and forever. Let's go option. And they're going man at least. Maybe we can get some yards out of this one. All on the seven yard line. I like the shift. Murray State comes out with an eye formation. He has some room. There we go. Let's just dive and get a first down there. I'm going to stay here. Uh, no, let's go. I'm trying to see here. We got... I need to switch something up. I need to go... For, let's go back to formation subs. I would prefer Gladhard right here. And we can do Davidson right there. We can stay in this formation. I want to try. Where's it at? I can get to it. There it is. PA screen. We got to hurry up. We're going, man. I'm going to have to call a timeout. Dang it. That's my fault. It just... I waited way too long. We'll go offensive line here. Uh, let's do speed option. It's first and ten. They're going man. Just don't shift hard to the right. They're going back to a five-two. Ah, dang it. The racers go with the I formation. Guess we're going to the left. Get some yards. A seven -yard run Get a seven-yard gain out of that. Second and three. Let's go slot corner. We normally call this on a red zone situation, but. Nothing stopping you from calling it anywhere else. Murray State lines up with a split backfield. Simmons back to pass. Throws complete. Just get the first down, not a whole lot. That was a well designed play. Yep, good execution there. Nice job. Of uh, look, we can try. I'm trying to see what else we got here. Slot. Let's go RB deep. We're going man, and 
this may not be the best thing. We'll just see what happens. Murray State comes to the line with three wide. Simmons. I snap. He stalled. Thank the Lord that happened. We may get a touchdown here. Thank the Lord the impact corner tried to die for the ball. I was really worried about throwing it in his direction. Very fortunate on that play. So we're on the nine yard line. Let's go fullback over. We're going man. I'm happy with that. As long as they don't shift super hard to the right. Let's see if Davidson can get in the end zone. The racers line up with two tight ends. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Fumble. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Oh, geez. Very fortunate on that one. So it's second and goal on the 10 yard line. We are on the left. Uh, let's just go back. Let's go back to slot corner. The shift is okay. It just depends on who's going to be on they line up with Myers. Simmons. Drop back to pass. Let's it fly. Let's see if we can get... Oh, didn't get in. I swear. <laughs> I should have dove. He's just not fast enough. So let's try weak tight. I got power option. I thought I had speed. Maybe I didn't. Let's do power option. We're going man. What I may try to do, I don't know if Green can handle it, but we're going to go to the, this way. And I tried to, dang it, it didn't pitch. Come on. We'll kick a field goal. I just don't trust it. He didn't pitch. I hit the button and it didn't work. So we'll kick an extra point. Let that clock roll. Hopefully my kicker can handle it. I just don't. Just don't trust us right now on the goal line of this situation. And I may have missed this. And I missed it. Ooh, he got it in. I hit the button way too late. I'm just not the best. I mean, kicking on Heisman is super hard. I know that's one of the reasons why a lot of people avoid Heisman. But it just comes down to practice, and I don't even practice enough. I should. And see, this is another bad button press. So minute 17 to go. I'm afraid this quarterback is going to give us nightmares all day. Unless we can force turnovers. Oh, something like that will work. How about that? So it's a minute 13. Let's see if we can get down the field some. Now he's got to go back out there and play smart. That was just a bad throw. He just threw it a little too hard. So it's a minute 13. Let's go deep outs. Let's see how well our freshman can handle some of these throws. Go and cover one. It's a pretty decent throw. It was kind of... He had to wait on it a little bit. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. Let's go RB deep. We're going zone. I'm trying to figure out ways to get the outside a little quickly. I snap. Somehow, okay, we'll break this play down. This is kind of wild. So I got a true freshman center, and sometimes when you got bad awareness at center, you're going to have high snaps from the gun. And this is what happened. I was going to go to. This guy over here, regardless since they're going zone. But I had a high snap, and I was fixing to get sacked. You can zoom in right here and notice. I was fixing to get sacked right there. It's a miracle we got that ball off. And somehow, we got out of bounds. I don't know how, but we did. Okay. Uh, let's... Second and five. Let's go half back out. This is on my mind, so we're going to run it. The going man. I think what I may do. Ugh. And he's being double teamed. I may just run it with the quarterback. Just get out of bounds. 50 seconds. We can try. We could try this RB crosses again. We're going man. Let's... Their shifting's probably going to make it hard for me to 
Let's just see what happens here. They're bringing both safeties. Short armed it. Short armed it. Just a bad throw. It was a bad, bad throw. Let's go power option. I just feel like passing it just, I don't know. I just don't know if Simmons, it's just an if and an iffy situation with him. Wow. They just, somebody came right on through. Third and 12. Deep bounce. I feel like I got no choice. I think we're too far out for a quarterback or for a kicker to get a touchdown. And our tight end drops. So we wasn't going to get the first anyways. Um, I don't want to trust our kicker in that situation. So I'm going to go for it. I just feel like I got no choice. I just don't trust our kicker. I don't trust myself either. So they're going zone. I feel like this may be going to Johnson. Six DBs in the lineup. Drops back to pass. Looking. Throws to the middle. Oh, and he drops it. Golly, come on. That was a great throw. All right, can we survive these 34 seconds? That was a wasted opportunity right there, but that was... Come on, Johnson. You got to make the catch. QB draw. They're going to call a timeout. They're going to call a timeout. I'm going to just stay in quarters. Can we survive? The the quarter. We can somehow get there and just get the ball at the beginning of the third when we can reevaluate. There he goes. Somebody tackle him. Somebody. Come on. We're not even blitzing hard. We're not blitzing at all. And there he goes, and I'm afraid to do any type of spy. I just don't, they don't work all that great at times. There he goes again. You gotta be, I'm about to fumble, fumble, gee whiz. Okay, we're gonna have, I guess we'll have to do spy on the right side. <laughs> I guess we got no choice. If he keeps turning the ball over like this, he may get benched. He didn't even get hit hard. He just kind of coughed it up. So where are we? It's on the 31. I'm just going to take a knee and go to half. I think we're too far back. I don't think it's worth it. The impact corner is in the zone right now and looking to take away half the field. So that first half was kind of weird. And the offense... Honestly, it, it kind of does fine until we get towards the red zone, but we'll figure it out. We can look at our yards. If our yards look halfway decent, then I guess the offense is doing okay. Our passing game, I think, is going to be a struggle this year, though. <clears throat> All right, only 156 yards on the of offense. Just nothing great. Very fortunate that they're turning the ball over, though. He's had two bad throws and a fumble. He keeps doing that. He'll get benched, and they can put in the pocket passer, then we could probably have some fun with it. Simmons, 6 of 9, 87 yards. Maybe I need to trust him more on some of these throws. I'm not really sure, but running the ball, Gladhart only had two attempts. That We got to fix that. So we need to fix that. Maybe we need to do basic runs with that guy. He does not, he needs a whole lot more than just two rushing attempts. So that's going to be our focus in the second half. Missouri got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. Kicks it off. Of course, our quarterback is the one who's been making all of the plays. That's just kind of what they're giving us offensively or defensively. So, for example, we can do basic slam here. At least he's going to be guaranteed to carry the ball. But our best player needs to be touched the ball a whole lot more than two times. So we're going to try to take care of that if possible. Well, Tech or Matadi just got beat badly. Big time. Let's go speed option, make up for it, I guess. And they're going zone. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 24 yard line. The Racers line up with two tight ends. And this ain't looking good. And now he pitches it. And now we're in a third and long situation. Third and six. 
Um. I want to run the ball. I just don't trust. I don't know. We're going zone nine. On their own 29. I like what I'm seeing right there, but. The racers set up in the gun. Here's an option. Right side. He lateral Pick up the first down. Just enough. Jeez. Shoved out of bound. And that was a right now, I'm not very comfortable with the offense. It's just not really jiving. Yeah, it really was. We'll get it fixed, though. In time, we will get it fixed. Let's go uh, back to tight end corner. We're going zone. It's first and ten. We got a couple options here. Pro formation here. They'll throw on first down. He tosses it short. As his fullback. He's not That's why I like to have Myers out in the open space because he can just blow people by, run people over. Throw it to him again. Uh, I'm trying to say, I feel like I'm forgetting plays, but let's go back to a basic option. They're going man five. They're loving this five two. Maybe that's what's hurting us. Number thirty-four is a deep back because they line up in the eye. Get a block right there. He ain't going to do it. Good defense by the safety. I guess I pitched it too early. What a play! Just a simple option play here. The quarterback. Let's go here, and I'm going to try PA screen. This is impressive. They're going zone. I'm going to give this to. Only thing that worries me is that impact corner, but we're going to give this to Gladhar. High formation here. Simmons still has it. Throws off balance. Complete. Hey, get a few yards there. They just took what the defense gave them on that play. Yeah, you're right. That was a good job of getting that pass completed for positive yardage. Let's let's just go full back over. I think Davidson should be fresh. We're going zone. This is a seventh play of this. We'll go to the right. I'm gonna leave it as is. Davidson again. And wrap him up. Brought down. Olsen's not blocking very well. Third and four. Let's do slam. This is going to be two down territory for me. We'll just hand it off to Gladhar. That was a crazy play. Let's break this down. I don't know where to go, to be honest. They had too many bodies on the right side, so I feel like we need to go to the left where they were spread out. So that's just like a good setup defensively that confused me. My left guard got pushed back pretty easily. That kind of messed me up. Thankfully, my left tackle done his job right there and was able to get the first down. How about that conversion on third down? Good Crazy play. Uh, so where are we? I need to put in, let's put my tight end slot right there. These guys are playing real uh, let's do another right screen. Now. Let's do a halfback screen. First and ten. Ball on the twenty. We're going man. We can bring this guy over just in case. And I got hit as soon as I threw it. Make it intercepted. Thank it. Thank it. Pressure. The pressure. Somebody came through. Of course, we're running a screen. I should know better. I got hit as soon as I threw it. So I, I pretty much knew I had no chance on that one. Uh, back to the grind we go. They're at the one. They line up in the jumbo set. Be awesome when we get a safety here. Daniel set to go to the air. He throws it. And we got a safety. <laughs> we'll take you the points however we can. So that was a bad play call on my part on that screen. I should have known better. Just don't fumble it. Back on the left hash. Let's go. Let's do a speed option from slot. They're going man dime. And he's being double teamed. I'm hoping if I move this guy over. That should help a little bit, and it looks like it will. Good block there by Green. Wow. Simmons feels really slow. He just felt really slow on that play. And we didn't get the first, of course. Let's just go back to slam. Can we get the and the going 5 2? I may go to the right. Uh, no, we're going to go to the left. You'd think Olsen's going to block for us a little bit better. 
Then green every wheel, and of course we get stopped. Ah, uh, jeez. Third and two. I'm going to go, I don't know what to call. They're going to go direct, I guess. They're going zone. And they're shifting hard that way. Dang it, I got to call time. I just don't trust that. Go backfield. Let's uh, go speed option, maybe. And they're going man. Five two. They're loving this 5-2 now. The racers come out showing three wide. Here's At least we didn't get a high snap on that one. Let's just get down. Nice running on the option there. That was a spectacular uh, option keeper there. And I'm gonna tell you why. It looked like that play was going let's nowhere, see. but this quarterback made the right go back here. On to the let's go RB clear. Can we stretch the field a little bit? Are they gonna let us? They're going man. Cover zero, I'll try to go to Myers. If not, we'll just probably go to Johnson. Maybe if he can catch it. They'll throw on first down. And a, what in the world? Nobody can pick this guy up. Wow, that looks a little like 09 right there. Just completely missed him. Maybe that's my fault. I keep backing up too much. Just did not pick him up. So one of the veterans of this defense gets in there. Second and forever. They've got to do a better job of protecting their quarterback. Yeah, he can't afford to take too many more hits like that. Try speed option again. This is the fifth play of the current drive. Just not a whole lot's working today. Murray State lines up in a double tight set. They'll run the option. Lateral's back. Sheds that one. Just didn't get a lot out of that. We got some yards, but not a whole lot. Third and 11. Go deep outs. They're going zone. Interception. Just a terrible throw. He's hit and got away. Oh, just a bad throw. I, they went cover three. I thought I was going to be able to squeeze it in there. My tight end didn't get open either. He just a tad bit overthrew it. Nobody else was on. That's like the perfect defense for that play. And that was their second interception of the game. Oh, my gosh. Just nothing's jiving with this offense. So I might have to probably switch up after this game. It's just nothing's working. I feel like it's a real struggle to get things going and it shouldn't be. We're going with that quarterback play. Get a stop right there. Good deal. Lost yards there. I'm going to just stick with quarters. We do just find up until the third down, and then it's a... We can't seem to figure out what to do after that, but maybe we can get it back to a third and long. Right, they're going with the QB choice. It's fine by me. We're going to go back to clap. This time I'm going to do the spy. I'm not very good at it. But we're going to do it right here. Intercept at somebody. He overthrew it. It's fine by me. But he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high. And that's something he's been working very hard with his coach on. Let's do double cross. I think we'd be able to return this. I think there's enough room. And their punter's not very good. He's a lefty. Ready to put this one away. He gets it off. Just not going to get a block on that guy, are we? Man, we'll just fair catch it. Just play it smart. Um, what should I call? Let's just give it back to Gladhar. They're going man 4 3. We'll run basic slam. The shift is okay. Murray State sets up in the eye. Wow. I mean, could anybody block today? Wow. That actually gives me a little bit of hope. Well, I, 09's got other issues, but my tackle decided to go for the safety instead. That's the second time we've seen that today. That happens all the time in 09, but if that happens some in 06, then I shouldn't get as upset over it in, in 09. Second and long again. And we're going, man. I just completely forgot we're in the middle of the field. Uh, 
He's being double teamed. Line up with split big dog, big dog. Simmons, back to throw. He's looking. He's Can Green make a play? Ah, you got to be kid. Nothing is working the day. I mean, just an absolute crap show. He just dropped it. I mean, I got, mm, I don't know. I got a lot of thinking to do. They're going man on this. I thought the thing we can get a first down. Cover one. And just a bad throw? I don't... I mean, what? I mean... It's just one of those days. I mean, there's just no explanation where just nothing is going right offensively. I, I don't know what to do about it. Hopefully, we can just survive this game and get out here with a win. But I have my doubts. We, we can't take advantage of their mistakes. So back to defense we go. They have the ball before? Exactly. He was three and out so fast they had to ask for slow ball replay to recap it. Daniel drops back to pass. He'll dump this one off. Oh, uh, dang it. I thought I was right there to make the play. McBride brings him down. The quarterback just oh, that one down. I'll just keep going quarters. The defender had no shot at breaking that pass up. Daniel back in the gun. What an awful game. Just no fun for either team. It's just a big slog is all it is. Wide open. I had to go after the, the side. I had to go after the halfback. He was wide open. I had to go in his direction. Left him wide open. Pretty much a stick concept. Executed and the result is a first down. First and ten. Ball on the twenty-six. Missouri lines up in a shotgun set. They would be killing us right now if they didn't have so many turnovers. Back to pass. He steps up, looking. Wide open. Somebody somehow it just. That's not me. That's on the corner to handle that. Good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, I'm just ready to get out of this game. This is getting to be ridiculous. Just nothing is dropping. He drops back, steps up. He's going. Ah, you gotta be ah! Sit right there, and it just nothing. He still got the touchdown. It's almost if the receiver told the defense. That's just hmm. Missouri. I have no answers. Wide open. And it, 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 it don't matter. He went with the wrong guy and still got it. I don't know what to do. I run more option, I guess. There's nothing else is working. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Kicks it off. I'm gonna let that one go just in the end zone. Let's just run option. Zone. For, now look at this. Now they're spreading. It's just like it doesn't matter what I call. They're making the perfect decision. I don't know. I just don't have any answers for it. And I completely botched that one. I'm about to just lose my mind right now. I'm afraid to pass. I mean, that's not working either. And they shift in that direction. It's like they're just making the right decisions. Hey, look at this. I don't understand. It's like everything is just going to pot. Nothing is working, and I don't know what to do. I'm just about to... Hmm. About to lose it. Zone, but I just don't trust it. I have no faith that this is going to work. Simmons comes to the line with three wide. He's looking. And just the ball is tipped. Whatever. Whatever. Just the worst game you could possibly imagine. We just deserve to lose. So bad. I've never seen such a poor performance offensively. Murray State ready to put this one away. And I botched this kick as well. This and this game's over with. I I, mean, I could just tell nothing's. He hauls it in I just, whatever. And now a slight break in the so bad. They're fixing to blow us out right here. We're not talented enough to come back and beat them anyways. And look at this. Look at this. Look at that. What in the world's going on? I don't get it. 
stop the carry and weed through that defense for a score. He found some well, we finally got a loss. And just, just might as well get the loss now over with. I, I don't understand it. And he hits the PAT. So with just over three minutes remaining in the fourth quarter, the score is Missouri. Just finish the game and I'll be done with it. I, I, I hate this off. It just it doesn't feel good whatsoever. Even on the good gains, we're just not getting anything out of it. Nothing's working. I don't know. I don't know what to call. I, I can't pass. I don't trust him. Everybody keeps dropping the ball. And look, look at this perfect shift. Oh, it makes no sense. Here's an opening. I just whatever. So they keep him in the field of play, guys. Yeah, good pick up here on the ground, but I bet the coach would have been happier if he was able to. And I picked the wrong play. play. God dang it, I swear. The clock stops to move the chains, but it'll start again. It's just it's not my day. So they have to hurry up. Simmons drops back. Not my day at all. Complete. He has some room. And they make the stop. The pass good for maybe seven yards. Seven yard game on the play. Go half back out. Second and three. Ball Zone line. nickel. Simmons. Back in the gun. Look. Throw. Terrible throw. Wow. Well, I just I'm sorry. It's just not meant to be today. It's third down and three to go. Ball on the 43. The word I, I don't I don't know. I just I wish I had some answers. I just don't right now. Looking. He tosses it short. And it's caught. Very forced to get the first down. We had jump the snap situation right there. Both look by both my tackles. And I guess that's me backing up too much. I don't know. And why? I, mm, I didn't mean to do that. This defense is looking to their impact corner to make a play. I don't even know what they're calling. Simmons drops back on first down. He lets it go. I am watching him fumble it. Clark. Lays it on him, and the pass is caught, but he goes nowhere. Yeah, nice job there by the defense to get to him and make the sure tackle before he can make any moves to break loose. I'm just picking plays at this point. This is the sixth play of this drive. The racers go with the eye formation. Simmons. Options out. Look at this. Their defensive line is incredible. We may get a touchdown out of this, but still didn't get the touchdown. Still didn't get it. Here on the pitch out to the tailback, they were able to capitalize with the defense on their heels. I'll tell you what, that defensive call, whatever it was, was not And they're going way. zone, and of course I'm going the wrong zone, direction. That's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Touchdown. Get a touchdown there. And they punch it in on the ground. Kick an extra point. But it's a minute 58, I feel like we got to do an onside kick. And we're just going to have to get lucky. And he tacks on the extra point. So with less than two to go in the fourth quarter, the score is Missouri 22, Murray State 19. Hope for the best here. We got all three of our timeouts, but... And he picks it up. Of course he does. That was a terrible kick, by the way. I'm figuring they're going to go run the ball. So I'm going to go man. If I was them, I would just run it. And there he goes. Look at this. Look at this! Uh, fumble! And of course they get it! God dang it, it just... Mm. They have to do a better job just whatever it's gotta be so sad just we I've never seen such a disastrous performance before Missouri lines up they're gonna run it here and I only got one timeout left so if the game's over with He's up in the second and 12 we'll just go all out blitz second down and 12 ball on the 24. This defense better be careful. The quarterback is in the zone and really feeling it out there. Jackson gets the carry. Abdullah brings him down. Third and 11. There. Just try to keep that clock I'm going to do quarters. Clock running. And keep I still think they're going to run it, but I'm going to... Daniel lines up in the shotgun. Yeah. 
But they're going to kick an extra or a, a field goal, and we're going to have to figure out a way to get a touchdown. But we've got to get a stop here first. Interception somehow. There's a missed tackle. Just don't fumble it. Why would you Gee whiz. Okay. You've got the lead. And it's simple. You don't. That was not a good choice by the quarterback. It sure wasn't. Um, play. Dump the ball short. Call a draw play. Let's go option. They're going man. Don't, put the ball in the air where the deep don't shift to the right, play. please. Dang it. Murray State sets up in the eye. I don't trust my play Seven. calling here. On the option. Broke away from one. And now he's got oh my the gosh. The 50. Oh the gee whiz. To the 20. To the 10. Goodbye. Oh, uh, the the maybe that's what we need to do. We just need to go just run the ball and power option and just avoid the passing game altogether. Great block by Sam as that was the play of the game right there. Well, obviously it was, but that was individually that block by the quarterback. So we're gonna get an extra point, hopefully, then go up four, then hopefully get another stop if we can. And I, mm. we're gonna do another high kick. I don't trust him on the uh, on the return. He should get this around the 35. I wonder if they put in... Well, they're going to throw it anyways. What worries me is he's going to run out of it. I'm going to try to get out of position if possible. They, they kept him in there. He's got four turnovers. They're going to keep him in. Ooh. Second and ten. Go back to quarters. I probably need to throw in a spy of some sort. I forgot what the shortcut is for that. Good play there. We're going to call a timeout. Third and eight. We're going to go cloud. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on their own 35. They shift on their defensive front. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He'll dump this one off. Okay, it's fourth down. We're going to call another timeout. And I'll probably just call the same thing. But fourth and five, I can see him do a couple different things. They shift on the defensive line. I feel like I need to do the spy, though. If I was them, I'd probably just run it with them. But they may run it, period. Nope, they're going to P.E. Reed. He passes it. Game over. Gee whiz. Uh, somehow, some way, we're going to get a win. I agree. They can't afford to let the other team hold on to the ball. I just... They got one timeout. The game is over. QB Neal. They'll set up shot at the 38 yard line. Uh, okay. I still got a lot of thinking to do. No need to risk a we may just need to just stick to the run game hard. Calls a timeout. As you can, our, our biggest problem, I'm just not going to lie, our biggest problem is we don't have any speed. Second Harris had down. some speed, Ball but our running backs aren't the fastest guys in the world. State is about ready to celebrate a big victory here. One more snap ought to do it. Look at that four for nine on third down. Simmons, he's just not a good enough passer. I, he just had a lot of bad throws. Uh, and I didn't put him in good spots either to handle it. Oh, my gosh, though. What a goofy game. I don't know how we came out with a win. We were down 10 in the fourth. He threw that interception late. I, I thought for sure they was probably going to run it and just go for a field goal. If you have any ideas, I'm all ears on what to do offensively. Just let me know. I want to hear it. A goofy game. Uh, wins a win. Just a, uh, okay, let's look at some stats. I don't, I don't think it's going to say a whole lot. <laughs> Nothing positive, that's for sure. That's the number three game all time. Uh, let's look at the stats. 
368 yards. Our defense is going to be fine all year. I'm not too worried about the defense. Offensively, we just got to figure some things out. As you could tell, we ran the ball a whole lot more than we threw it, and I feel like that was for the best. I mean, we went 11 for 20. We had drop passes and such, and bad throws here and there. We got sacked twice. That's what really messed us up. Their defensive line really done damage to us. 40% on third down. That's nowhere near good enough. A whole lot of turnovers. Just bad quarterback play by both teams. Uh, Yeah, just bad play all around. Just wanted to see here. Let's go uh, individual stats. 11 to 20. He had two interceptions. Both of them... I guess they were my fault. I know he. I guess he doesn't have a good enough arm to th put in that tight window like Davis does. So I may have to figure out what to do on the third and long. Do something a little bit different. Running the ball. Gladhar, finally, we gave him, what, 11 touches running the ball in the second half. That's still 13. It's nowhere near enough. Simmons ended up with 14 attempts. Of course, when you run option, anything's possible on who's going to keep the ball. But maybe we just got to focus on running the ball a whole lot. Receiving. Every mind their brother somehow touched the ball. I don't know how. But none of the numbers look good at all. They didn't do any cover zero. That's another thing. The one or two times they did, we ended up having a bad pass or I just missed it all together. Defensively, McBride done the most at corner. Crosby. Crosby had a big game. I had that one interception early. Abdullah and Potts didn't do a whole lot. Potts ended up getting one interception. That was the one late. Just a goofy game. So let's somehow... Uh, I'll have a couple of days to think about it and see what we can do offensively. I don't need a hundred different ways to run speed option or power option. I just need a couple. So maybe we're going to let this thing simulate. We're going to see... Uh, there's nothing really to see here. But again, just let me know your thoughts offensively. What I probably need to be doing, I'll put that in the post-game thoughts as well. Uh, only thing I know to do is just run the ball more, and because that's all where our talent lies. Because right now, Simmons, he's not consistent enough throwing the ball. We'll come up with something. I have a couple ideas in mind. I think what we may do is maybe do more uh, strong side flat stuff with the halfback. I think he can get separation there. Myers can't. That's why we only do that for red zone purposes because he doesn't have the speed just to outrun linebackers consistently. Gladhart may be able to. All right, come on back. We'll take on number 17, Ohio State. They've got one loss. Who knows why they got beat? They may have went up against a good team or they had injuries. Who knows? It's going to be quite the challenge because, as you can tell, they are loaded. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.